Humanity has faced a lot of conflict over the years. One of the most consistent has been with disease. Luckily, in recent years, we've actually beaten a lot of it. But the problems that we haven't solved yet, they're pretty tricky. Our population is aging, and deaths from Alzheimer's are climbing. The disease affects about 5.7 million Americans today, but without any breakthroughs, that number is expected to balloon to around 14 million by 2050. At this rate, for those of us who make it into old age, a third will meet our end with some form of dementia. Those aren't great odds. One organization stepping up to the plate to deal with this growing problem is the Alzheimer's Association, the leading voluntary health group for Alzheimer's care, support, and research. This is a national uh, signature event for Alzheimer's. I think it's been going on for three years now. Hi, I'm Elaine Griffin. I work for the Alzheimer's chapter here in Center City, Philadelphia. Today is the longest day, the summer solstice, and we have created the longest day to honor our caregivers who give the ultimate gift, caring for the loved one who has Alzheimer's disease. Uh, Alzheimer's disease can go on from four to 20 years, so this is a long, grueling process, quite honestly. It's not a normal part of aging. It is a fatal brain disease that we have no survivors as today, as of now, we have no survivors. So what our chapter does, and chapters, uh, Alzheimer's Association chapters throughout the country, is we have our helpline, which is open 24-7. It is translated in 160 languages, and it is the portal for any question you might ever have about Alzheimer's, if you're worried about your loved one, if you need information, if you need resources, you name it, we've got it. And that number is 800. 272-3900. You could also go on our website, alz.org, and everything you need to know is right there. Thank you, and let's work together to create a world without Alzheimer's disease. I've always felt that something strange about Alzheimer's coverage in the media is that, for whatever reason, it seems to have less momentum than a lot of the other major diseases do, at least in the public consciousness. Everybody seems to know what it is. They seem to be familiar with the uh, dementia and how it causes people to lose their memories and a lot of their cognitive faculties, but it just doesn't seem to have the same push as far as funding, awareness of the research, of the care and stuff like that, uh, many of the statistics and things. And that's a shame because unlike a lot of other diseases in the U.S. that get a lot of attention, a lot of other diseases, certain cancers and stuff like that, where there's been a lot of progress, Alzheimer's is a disease where well, we still don't even have a grip on what causes it. And the number of cases, the amount of money that it costs our economy, uh, overall as a problem, it's just getting worse right now. It's not getting better. So if this topic interests you, we're going to be covering it more this summer and this year. We're going to be talking with experts. If we get the opportunity to, we're going to be talking about how the disease works, what we know about where it comes from, what we don't know, some of the most recent findings, actually, between the filming of this video and right now, when it's almost done, there actually was just released some new research that suggests it might be associated with certain viruses. So this is a disease that is still very much being actively fought. I feel that as far as like the public consciousness goes, a lot of folks don't really realize uh, just how much of a pickle we're in already, how much of a rough spot we're going to be in if things continue to get worse as they have been. So uh, yeah, this stuff is important and we're going to be talking about it more both here on Long Story Short and with coverage from WHIP Radio. So thank you for the uh, thank you to the Alzheimer's Association, Delaware Valley Chapter for letting us film a bit at their fundraiser and talking to us. We'll be talking to them more about Alzheimer's and the Alzheimer's Association later this summer and moving into the next academic year. So if this topic interests you, I do hope that you come back. And if it doesn't interest you, well, <laughs> think about it more. This is important. Thank you all watching again. I'm Tony Pearson from Long Story Short, WHIP Radio. Have a good one.